J.I. Clemens Stadium was host to a matchup between rivals on Saturday when the Appalachian State Mountaineers took on the Georgia Southern Eagles in a doubleheader. The Eagles won game one of the doubleheader with a final of 8-6. to six. The Georgia Southern was in full control until they lost the lead at the top of the eighth. A solo home run by J.P. Ty tied the game at 6, and a two-run homer by Jared Brown took the lead for the Eagles. Game two was a slaughter by the Eagles. The bats got started early in the game and kept it up the rest of the day. The Eagles would finish with 19 runs on 17 hits, and they made quick work of Appalachian State in game two. The final was 19 to five. I was able to talk to Coach Hennon to get his thoughts on how his team played. You know, we, we kind of put it together in, in all phases today. We got good pitching, uh, you know, got the offense going, swinging, some, swinging the bats, and uh, did some good things defensively, some mistakes in the, in the second game, but overall a, a pretty good day. And, uh, but really pleased with the way we pitched today in these two ball games. The Eagles with the Teddy's momentum on the road as they travel to take on Kennesaw State and Marshall this week. This has been Kiwan Humphreys reporting in Statesboro, your newsroom. Kiwan, how big were these wins for the baseball team? The Eagles have been fighting to get back to 500 for the past couple of games. But with the two wins on Saturday, the Eagles improved their record on the season to 18-18. With two-thirds of the games in the season already played, it is important that the Eagles find some consistency and some continuity to take with them for the rest of the season. But hopefully two wins against a rival is a good way to spark them for the rest of their year. To keep up with the Georgia Southern baseball team, be sure to follow them on social media at GSAthletics underscore BSB.